long as I'm in a good pair of heels, I'm fine. Renee Zellweger sported a lot of looks over the years, and E.T. has been there for it all. Oh, look at that. Yes, look at that. We're taking it all the way back to 1999. Renee gracing the Oscars red carpet in a timeless silk gown designed by Loren Scott. Fast forward to 2001. Renee was at the top of the A-list and looking A plus in this simple yet sophisticated look. It's Galanas. We decided we were gonna do something different and vintage and yeah. Renee kept with the vintage vibe as she progressed through the 2001 awards season as she donned a sophisticated yellow gown to the 2001 Oscars. And in true E.T. style, we needed to know the details. It's all John to say. You can't get a whole lot in there, can you? Only the really, really important stuff. Speaking of important stuff, we picked up on a trend in Renee's red carpet rotation. She loves a strapless gown. It's vintage Valentino, straight from the closet in Rome. Do you believe this never made it off the catwalk? Isn't that crazy? Valentino was also a theme for Renee. She sported the Italian designer at multiple award shows in 2003. It's Valentino. I saw it and I thought, I like that. You don't try on a thousand things? And well, I kind of know. You know, you get dressed enough, you kind of know. It was going to feel <laughs> comfortable. And I just thought it was beautiful. I love these sleeves and the lace. So it just felt really classic. I like it. Classic is definitely the Zellweger vibe. Remember this bow moment? Or should we say bow down moment at the 2004 Oscars? Renee, it just gets better and better and better. What other excuse do you have? 2004 wouldn't be the last time Renee would show up to a red carpet in designer Carolina Herrera's striking silhouettes. The 2006 Golden Globes and the 2007 Met Gala both got the Herrera touch. I love Renee. Renee has been connected to to my house for 10 years, Renée Selweger, and uh, she likes fashion and she looks fabulous. Renée was a red carpet staple until 2007. She popped up at a few events, but then kind of disappeared for a bit. Um, wow. God, how much do we tell here? But she came back in a big way in 2019, hitting the big screen as Judy Garland in Judy. Our Judy has arrived, and if you think Renee Zellweger looks dazzling on this red carpet, you've got to see this movie. Renee dazzled on and off the red carpet all year long, even paying homage to the late Judy Garland. A little brocade in Judy's honor. Renee brought the glitz and glam to the 2020 Golden Globes, where she won for Best Actress while in a periwinkle colored bustier gown by designer Armani Privé. It is Armani Privé, custom Armani Privé, and I feel so lucky. I love it. It's like getting a hug, a pretty sparkly hug. I love it. <laughs> From the 2020 SAG Awards to the Critics' Choice Awards, BAFTAs, and to the upcoming Oscars, we have been and will continue to cheer Renee on for her incredible style. I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> ET, always there.